Now, meet a gentle giant. She's not waiting to get pregnant, she's waiting to give birth. This is Bihan, a one and a half ton Indian rhino at Whipsnade Zoo. She may look intimidating, but Bihan is a sweetie. It's hard to imagine that recently this big girl's actually been putting on weight. She's expecting a baby and she's been pregnant for almost a year and a half. At birth, Bihan's baby will weigh as much as a fully grown man. Cue Veronica, her adoring and very patient keeper. Veronica has known Bihan since she was a baby. She came to Whipsnade as a one-year-old calf and Veronica has been a constant companion for 13 years. Um, yeah, she always likes to know what's going on and if there's anything happening around the area, she'll always be up there trying to see what, see what it is. But she's very friendly, very friendly. There's such a strong relationship between them, it's no wonder that Veronica is concerned about mum and baby. It's been a 16-month wait and there are no guarantees. It is nerve-wracking but very exciting at the same time. You never can be 100% sure, as with all animals. They're very unpredictable. Some of them can have them very quickly and some of them have a very long labour. Big girly. Hello. <laughs> Give me a kiss. Indian rhinos have been around for some 10 million years. But hunters relentlessly shot them for sport. In such numbers, they were very nearly extinct by 1900. And now, although protected by park rangers, they're targeted by poachers for their horns. Over 70% of the entire world population is in one park in India. And if that park got hit by disease, flooding, civil war, it could be disastrous. And if that happened, captive bred rhinos like Bihan's baby could offer a crucial safety net. There's a lot at stake and nothing is being left to chance. Bihan is monitored night and day by CCTV so Veronica can keep watch without disturbing her. Very often if animals know that they're being watched, it will inhibit their birth. And it means we're, you know, we can always be on hand should the need arise for us to go in and assist her for whatever reason. But then it's just nice to be able to be there as well, to, to actually watch the birth. So now the end game begins. Bihan's baby will be just the third Indian rhino born in captivity this year. And right now, there's nothing Veronica can do but wait. <laughs>